Weppa, what's up everybody? Welcome to the Nail Pub YouTube channel. I am your host, Yali, and I thank you very much for tuning in today. Today, I come to you because I finally got my hands on the Magpie Beauty Spring Collection for this year. It's called Life is a Beach, and they are beautiful spring pastel neon colors. And I haven't seen something like that in other lines so I'm really excited to see what they look like they are eight different colors so I haven't even opened them yet they're still in the wrapping so I am just gonna share what they look like on the swatches and I thank you all of you for the ones who have watched the podcast episodes and comment and left your reviews uh, I'm really excited with the um, engagement and I hope that we can connect more um, like always uh, you can see everything that I'm doing at thenailpod.com. Um, I have some few classes coming up. And next week, I'm going to be at Nail Camp in Florida teaching two classes. I'm going to be teaching Magpie in the basis of nail art and how to use her crumbs or powders or dusts uh, and everything that they uh, do. And I'm also there to teach uh, clear jelly stamper and the basics and how to stamp. And I know it sounds very simple but trust me it's not as simple as it looks like there's a technique for that so join me today i hope you really like it and if you do please like and subscribe i am trying to grow the channel as much as i can and if you like to listen to podcasts just know that i do have a podcast called the nail pot podcast available anywhere you get your podcast um anywhere that your podcasts are available period so let's get started Okay, so we have all eight colors right here. Um, the bottle looks like the colors are pretty neon, but of course we'll have to see once we open the bottle. Uh, so we have aloe vera, piña colada, coco cabana, lilo lil, ice lolly, honolulu, sandy lane, and seashell. So let's get started on these. Okay, here is aloe vera. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, wow. Very nice, very nice. It's a neon green. Let's see what it looks like. Oh my gosh. Let me hold it to the camera so you guys can see it. Really cool thing about the Magpie gel products is that their gels are 100% gel. What that means is, oh my gosh, look at that. What that means is that there is no uh, regular polish mix in the gel. Um, it's 100% gel and they're very pigmented as you can see. I mean, look at that. It's almost a full coverage. I miss a little bit in the middle if you can see through the glove. But other than that, you can get away with this a little bit. Look at that. What a gorgeous green. I am, my, my mind right now is, I'm, I'm quiet because my mind right now is like running with ideas of what can I do, all the designs that I could do. Uh, oh my gosh, even their new green chrome will look amazing with this as a contrast. Oh my gosh. Their gels cure for 60 seconds, so I'm just going to put it here in the lamp in the cure for 60 seconds. Um, like I said, they're 100% gel, so they're not mixed with regular polish. Their pigmentation is amazing. Um, they are soak off, and in 10 minutes, they're completely gone. If you soak them in acetone, uh, you follow you know, the proper guidelines on how to remove gel. Um, and really, it's just you get your money's worth just because just one coat is almost a full coverage. And you don't need to apply a very thick coat. Um, you can go thin, right? Thin is better. Um, and it will provide still that color, that richness, um, and the consistency. And it's, their consistency actually is very creamy. I'll show you when we're done. But oh my gosh, I'm liking this green already. Well, that cur cures. I'm just going to go ahead and put it here on this huge tip. Oh my gosh, this green is just amazing. So you can see how creamy and pigmented they are. You really don't need to apply it super thick. Look at that. Oh my gosh. That's just gorgeous. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Oh, ooh I love it. With my skin tone oh heck yeah look at that Ooh, love it this is aloe vera you guys they look so neon right now in the lamp look at this oops hopefully you can see that under the lamp 
my gosh how cool is that <laughs> gotta put it back here because i am so clumsy look at this gorgeous neon green it is definitely spring it's definitely pastel but it's also neon oh my gosh i love it all right let's go with the next one okay so the second one is piña colada now for piña colada it looks like it's another green maybe um because of the label i really have not seen it so let's see what it looks like although i don't open it yet but piña is supposed to be pineapple so why would it be green i don't know so let's see <laughs> yeah no this is not green look at this oh my god this is a neon yellow i've been looking for a color like this for a long time look at that how creamy that is oh okay 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 let's see oh my gosh oh man yes oh this is beautiful yeah definitely a neon yellow it does have a little bit of a green hue in it but it's just very subtle maybe that's why the bottle looks like that but it's it's definitely yellow oh my gosh look at that oh and this is just one coat by the way well you decide okay i'm gonna pop it in the lamp look at that piña colada right there see what i'm talking about about the green hue look at that it is definitely yellow, but oh my gosh. Oh, I don't want to wear this one so bad. What do you guys think? Copacabana. I'm excited to see what this one looks like. Oh, yes. You know what? Camera actually does not give justice, and I think it's the light. It is, I want to say it's a coral, but more to, towards the orange side, and it's definitely neon. Um... I actually have a similar color to this, but not as pigmented as this one. Oh, this one is nice. This is sexy. I love it. All right. Okay, this is what Copacabana looks like. Gorgeous so far. Mm -hmm. So, you excited yet? <laughs> All right, let's go with the next one. The next one is uh, Lilo Lil. If somebody knows what this means, please tell me because I, I have no idea and I don't want to Google it. So, just comment below what Lilo Lil looks uh, it's, it's about. I don't know. I recognize the rest of the names, but not that one. <laughs> anyway, let's see. Oh, that's really pretty. Okay, it's a very bright neon uh, bubble gum. Really creamy. Very bright. Not sure compared to the other ones if it's really a neon, but it's definitely very bright, you know, compared to the other ones. So let me see what it looks like. A little claws here. That's really nice. I'm putting a lot just because I need to cover the full tip. This is what it looks like in a swatch. Again, very neon, but it's uh, not neon. I don't want to say neon. It's very bright. It's a bright bubble gum. Cute. I am not a pink person. Please don't hate me. Um, I love pink. They're gorgeous. But it's very rare that I wear, I wear something like this on my nails. Um, if I were to wear pink, it was probably a very dark pink. But this is gorgeous. And I have a few clients that they are obsessed with pink. So I know that they're going to love it. Oh my gosh, I love it, I love it. So for top coat, I'm using Don't Be Tacky, which is a shiny top coat that does not have an inhibition layer, so it's not gonna have a tacky end. Really cool, does not yellow the colors, which is what I love. I hate when top coats, you know, yellow over time. 
So definitely um, don't be tacky. And there's another top coat from Magpie called Like a Diamond that is com completely um, crystal clear. It has like a, a blue, purple uh, hue, which means that your colors are always gonna stay completely true to the color and no yellowing. Ooh, so cute. Yeah, well, that cooks. Let's go for Eyes Lolly. This is probably a pink that I will wear, but we'll see. Oh, oh, hey, 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 you, what's up? Oh, my, 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 look at that. Que bonita eres. My gosh, you're so pretty. This is definitely a neon pink. Where's my swatch? Here you are. Come here, you. Show me. Oh, man. Yes, yes. Yes, absolutely yes. I will wear this, even though I'm not a pink person, I will definitely wear this one. Oh my gosh. Ooh. This is so great. Okay, eyes lolly, let's see. Dee, dee, dee. Oh my gosh. Ay, mamacita. Que linda. Que chulería, me cago en nada, coño. Es una chulería en pote. It's amazing. Look at that. All right, I'm gonna cure it for 60 seconds and look at my swatch. Mm -hmm. Definitely will look really nice. What do you guys think? Yeah? Mm -hmm. Ooh. Then I'm gonna use Tomitaki and I'm gonna seal it. I'll be right back. Okay, next up is Honolulu, and it seems like it's a purple, so we'll see. Oh, yes. Definitely a spring purple. It is bright, however, it's not neon, but it is bright. Let's see what this one looks like. I'm excited. Dee -dee -dee. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment. Um, you can also find me on Instagram. Um, I'm very active on Instagram and Facebook. Um, I'm always responding to messages right away. If I can, of course. If I don't right away, that means I'm, I'm with a client unless it's a Sunday. Sundays are sacred for me. They are family time. So Sundays, I don't, I'm not available. Super pretty. This is definitely a pastel purple and it is bright, but it's not neon, but it's bright and it's beautiful. And this is just one coat as you guys saw. So. Look at that coverage. You can barely see anything from the tip. So I'm gonna go ahead and put in the lamp for 60 seconds. I don't know if I mentioned this to you guys, but um, MacPy uh, gel colors, they do cure in an LED lamp for 60 seconds and on a UV lamp uh, for two minutes. Really cool. All right, so it's done from the lamp. Look at that. Really, really pretty. Also my swatches here. Let's see, really nice. I will definitely wear this. I will definitely use this color with um, one of their purple chromes. Um, I can't remember the name right now, but there's a purple, beautiful chrome. I think it's called Marilyn uh, or Madonna. One of those two. Um, that is a very rich purple chrome, and it will go perfectly with this color. It's just, oh my gosh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So that's Honolulu for you guys. Now I'm just going to move on to the next one. I'm just going to move this one here. Yeah, all right. All right, next up is Sandy Lane. And Sandy Lane, by the label, it looks like maybe like a purple bluish. So let's see. Wait, dang it. These bottles are really sealed tight. Oh, man. Yep, it is definitely a blue purple. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. Beautiful, beautiful. It's definitely very bright. Not sure if it's neon. I don't think so. I'm going to apply it to the tip and see if it's neon. I have not seen this color before. Like, I don't have it in my collection. By the way, if you guys want me to do a studio um, tour where I can show you what is it that I'm doing and where do I serve my clients. Also, see the current gel collection that I hold. Um, I've been collecting different brands uh, for four years now. And now I'm just, like, trying to be a little bit more specific on the colors and brands that I like. Um, so I have a great variety. I have not seen a 
blue purple like this before this is absolutely gorgeous magpie has some flakes that are blue i think in purple so i think they're gonna go excellent with this color um oh my gosh my mind is just running with ideas with this color as well very spring it can also be used for fall it can also be used winter i mean i think any season you can use this color it is bright but not neon and it's definitely pastel it's I don't know it has like a purple blue even gray tone to it it's just absolutely gorgeous so i'm just gonna cure it and then show you the end product all right guys so this is the finished product look at that it's just gorgeous and while that was curing i was looking for some glitters that i have from magpie that i think it will look excellent with this color and i found them so this gorgeous glitter is called Danny and look at that that will totally pair with this one just because it has that blue purple tone into it even with um, Honolulu it will look amazing too you can do uh, an ombre you can do um, like a fade from the cuticle down or the uh, free edge up or a full glitter I mean it's up to you look at that also um, uh, we have this one um, Kyle Oh, Kylie, or Kaylee? No, Kylie, sorry, it's K-Y-L-I-E. And this one is the same as Danny, but this one is chunky. So again, perfect for fades, or you can even combine the both of them and make your own uh, mix. Um, another one that I thought it was really cute is, um, oh my gosh, can read the names. La Toya. La Toya is gorgeous. La Toya has purple, uh, blue and hints of like a rose gold it's a beautiful glitter will look absolutely gorgeous with both of them with honolulu it pulls those rose gold and purple and then with um with sandy lane it pulls the purple and blue and then the rose gold is just more in the background so definitely this glitters are a must have and um my gosh i love my my uh glitters they are premium they're amazing they don't fade out they don't lose color so i definitely definitely love them um so yeah so oh my gosh this is great okay so last one but not least is seashell seashell obviously is blue um so we'll see if it's neon i'm hoping that it is so blue i'm really hoping that it's neon or at least it's very bright so we'll see Ooh, definitely bright yes beautiful beautiful color i'm already thinking about summer and mermaid and under the sea kind of designs beautiful even um like clouds in it like it looks like the sky oh my gosh look at this this is just one coverage you guys one and i'm applying it really really thin like i'm taking all that excess out this is how creamy and high pigmented this gel is. Look at that. Okay, I'm gonna cure it and show you the end product. All right, here is seashell old cure and done with Don't Be Tacky. Again, gorgeous colors. So, what do you guys think? Amazing, isn't it? Now, the question that I was thinking while I was curing them was, how will they look in matte? So. I'll be right back. Okay, so I use the Magpie Velvet Top, which is their matte top coat. It's really great. Also, it does not yellow and lasts really good. And here are the colors, shiny and matte. I am definitely in love with this collection. Really, really pretty, amazing. And I like them in matte too, look at that. All right, guys, so final thoughts about the collection. It's so pretty, seriously. I think they're absolutely gorgeous. It is definitely a must have, especially if you were looking for neons. Um, I think this is just absolutely gorgeous. Um, there's a little bit of for everybody here from the bright to a little darker. They're still pastel, they're still very bright. Um, and you can use this in spring and summer. Um, it really doesn't matter it's very versatile 
their collection is just based on a spring collection, very bright colors and pastel. And I think they did a really good job on achieving that. Um, if you would like, I could match these colors with maybe some of the glitters that Magpie has or the chromes or anything like that. So just let me know what you think. Um, and I can just uh, swatch them and show them to you. Um, I really love them in matte as well, especially that that um, yellow one. Whew, that looks really, really amazing. So if you haven't gotten this collection yet, please do so. Um, I don't think there's anything similar down out there, um, but it's just, I just love it. So let me know what you think. It's getting dark, so I need to go home. <laughs> But um, let me know what you think. Leave any comments below. I would love to connect with you. And um, like always, you can see everything that I'm up to at www.thenailpot.com. And um, you can see about the podcast, the upcoming classes, and everything else. These colors are available at magpiebeautyusa.com. I also have them available in my store. Um, so just message me because right now I'm still working on the website. You guys, everything that I do is just me. I'm just one running the whole show. So be a little bit patient about the store and everything else, but I'm I'm working on that. So I hope we can connect soon. I gotta go home, it's kinda late. So I'll see you guys soon. Thank you, adios, goodbye.